Sky Profit, baby. Back with another video for you, man. Hope your day went good. Going good. You pitching it good. You, you expecting some good out of it. Setting your mind toward good things. Thinking in the right ways in which you should you need to be thinking to get these things. A lot of individuals, man, going through this transformation. A lot of individuals can feel it within themselves. A lot of individuals confused. It's like you don't know the way. The way is all within you. All you got to do is understand your feelings along the way. Understand what you realizing along the way. The hardest part about an individual figuring out their way is what an individual is doing wrong. And Prophet can assure you, man, it don't be nothing nobody be doing wrong on an individual note. Now, yeah, we know we got wickedness and shit like that now. We know how to act. But when it comes down to this word, sin... It's not a real thing. Sin is not a real thing. A lot of people gonna beg to differ with it. I I understand that. I understand that clearly. But what is it? What's a sin? That stuff that you do that God not supposed to like. It's things that you do that go against. Go against what God likes. God don't judge you. Never did. Never judge you one time. You just simply thought he judged you. From your own guilty conscience. You just thought he judged you. Because you understand your moral compass to yourself. You just thought and picked up that whole little story. Tainting your creator. If you can't displease God, if you can't make God be like that, how can you do anything wrong? I want you to understand that. And I know it's people saying, yeah, he's saying sin, sin don't exist, but it's wicked things. Nah. We all have a moral compass to me. Like, I know what I should be doing and what I shouldn't be doing. I know when I'm violating the next individual when I'm not. I understand my actions. Not the next individual's actions. and Their actions is not on me. Their actions don't apply to me like that. It's individual notes. We singing out here. Individual notes. We singing out here. So over and over and over, time and time again, you've came to these lives. You came within a lifetime and took on sin, took on wrong, took on bad. You know what's good for you and what's not good for you. You know exactly when you cross a boundary and when you don't. Now, you crossing a boundary has nothing to do with the boundary another individual would cross. And I think that's important because <coughs> no exceptions is just that. I have no control over how you make decisions, what you choose for your free choice. This is the only planet right now that has free choice. You see, you got free choice because you really don't know which way you're going to choose. You just don't know. Humans haven't reached that consciousness yet to understand that fully. But once you get to the point where you understand... Free choice is taken from you because you don't have no choice. You, you, you're going to have one choice. You're going to choose one way. 
these beings that's helping, that's assisting you, they at a higher vibration than you. Now, I want you to understand and picture yourself right now being able to love. You, you're able to love. You're able to make loving decisions. You're able to think out of love. You, you're able to do these things. But they at a way higher frequency than you, including with love. That's why they can assist you like they assist you. And I think individuals is waiting on, waiting to see people and waiting to, you know, see entities and all that. And everything is through your mind, man. Through your thoughts. How far can you expand your mind? Can you expand it far enough to where you don't see it, but you believe in it so much to where it appears for you? Because that's what a, man, a manifestation is. Just understand that you don't do nothing wrong on no global scale where other people can say you're doing things wrong. But you know your moral compass. You understand how you're supposed to be walking because you're unique from everybody else. See, the things you do and the places you go and the experiences you have, the next individual doesn't have it like that. Therefore, the next individual can't say what you do applies to them. Yeah, people take it on. But people be trending. People just want to copy. People want to be like the next individual. That's all trending is to me. So understand that you don't do nothing wrong. You, you, you just simply correcting yourself. Just yourself. Because there's a lot of individuals out there. I could look at things that they, they might have said they, it was wrong, and I, I don't feel like it was wrong. And vice versa. But you have to understand it so, you, so you're not looking at the next individual trying to, trying to see how you're supposed to be. Yeah, you could take these loving attributes from the next individual. But when it comes to a journey and a path and what you're supposed to be doing and how you're supposed to be moving and your decisions, that's going to be solely on you. And you going to know when you mess up. you going to feel that. Not the next individual. You. So protect your energy. Protect yourself to and from. Watch your surroundings. Watch what you're taking your ears. Watch what you give out your mouth. Help somebody if you can. Give somebody some words of encouragement if you can. Prophet got words of encouragement. Man. Don't you know if you practice love and practice showing love to the next individual, you don't even have to worry about sin or none of that stupid stuff that go with that? Sin was created. It was created. Sin was created way back in the days with these with these. When they gave you these gods way back when. On this planet, though. Created on this planet. Do you realize how much of a business sin is? Because that allows, see, individuals feel they can't fix themselves. So sin is just a way for you to go pay for you to get yourself fixed. But sin is a way for you to embed that you do wrong within yourself. It's a feeling nobody's supposed to give themselves. We learning. You learning. You encountering something and being able to have the opportunity to change it for the better, that's karma. That's karma at its finest. We don't look at it like that. And we need to start looking at life the right way. Protect your energy, protect yourself to and from. Watch your surroundings. Watch what you're taking your ears. Watch what you give out your mouth. Help somebody if you can. Give somebody some words of encouragement if you can. Words of encouragement. That infinity sign. 
That's forever. That's forever. Your intentions, if you're paying attention, is all within that infinity sign. What comes around, goes around. What comes around, goes around. Ain't nobody excluded from that. So pay attention to the energies that you're putting out there. Till next time, man. Sky Prophet, baby. Love everybody, man. Ah, peace out.